Hi everyone, it's the English Simmer here and welcome back to my short lifespan legacy challenge where I am actually attempting to do something that I don't think we've done throughout this whole series and that is finishing an aspiration in one part. Can we get the brand new Lovestruck aspiration done and dusted? Let me know in the comments down below how you feeling about it. Are you feeling confident? After our run of luck with the last generation, I don't know if I am. I was about to say, I probably shouldn't have listened to Pink Pony Club to get myself really hyped before recording this video, seeing what is happening to a mozo. But let's be real, it's just made me sad because I'm not seeing chapel tonight and I don't have a ticket. Now, I've just woken her up because we didn't have him use the drink to like revert his age. It's been a while since I've had an elder die. I know it's the short lifespan legacy and this should be like a recurring thing, but it felt like this generation, his particularly, has caused me so much trauma that it felt like it's lasted a thousand years. So I'm kind Kind of tempted to not even like beg for him. I don't think I'm gonna get on my knees for Grim. Whoa. I don't know. Maybe that's gonna be happening next month when we actually get the Grim Reaper pack. It didn't work anyway because Grim didn't even appear. He said, babes, I'm gonna be off uh, until next month until I can actually get someone to cover for me when we may potentially have a new Grim Reaper career, you know? So I'm gonna get all of you Sims to do my bidding eventually. I genuinely thought that he was just getting up because of the glitch that I'm having currently within my game, which is when I send a couple to bed. Apparently, they're trying to take inspiration from The Sims 2. The Sims really heard me say, I hate how you can be in like an unhappy marriage and still sleep in the same bed together and they have like no reaction. And was like, okay, bet. Let me see if we can switch this up a little bit. But it was just a glitch and they just kept getting like out of bed as soon as their partner got in. I've been thinking, we're seven generations deep into my Nightmare Legacy challenge. And we really, I feel recently as well, have have focused on like quite similar skills. Like I was gonna have him focus on logic and handiness, but I don't think I'm gonna go for that now. I think I'm still gonna have him focus on logic, but I think we're gonna throw a spanner in the works of rock climbing. I don't know why I have become a rock climbing enthusiast, not in my real life, don't worry. I'm not like looking at every single like tower or church or building that exists being like, I could, I could climb that. However, I really enjoy it within my game and I just felt like it was quite a good thing for Cornelius and Guy to get into. Oh uh, my goodness gracious me. Malcolm had another kid, Tanisha Langrab. Well, I never. Look who's spending his parents' money again when they don't have a lot, especially now that we don't have two incomes in the house. How I'm thinking I'm gonna actually purchase a property for him to become a landlord of, I don't know. Now that his dad's gone, he can actually transfer his marbles into his little jar. He already said, I'm tired of this grandpa. He left his romance book at school. Ooh, prom is coming on Saturday. You know uh, what that sounds like a perfect time to do? It sounds like it's perfect to uh, not relationships, um, social. Oh my goodness. Ask on. There we go. Ask to create a date. We already got a gold on the get to know you date. So we're actually uh, going to go for uh, for the romantic date. <gasps> Should we do a throwback? Our very first generation got married in this park in my Shuno Meadows. We have not been here literally since the first generation. This is wild behavior from me. I really said I'm sick and tired of the same old shtick in this short lifespan legacy. So I've really thought about like what careers and like skills I want the next couple of generations to be into. I really want like a musician sim, then I really, really would love a chef. And then uh, for the 10th generation, I don't really know. I'm like, should we do a throwback to the first generation and do an astronaut all over again? Cause I do think that could be fun, but then I don't want to bore you 
wall with that. So 10th generation, I haven't really thought about too much. You need to use the romantic blanket three times for romance and share food two times. Well, luckily we already have the donut drops. So we're gonna share those with Gloria. Oh my word, are those from like when we were getting married? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, stop it. We literally, I put my whole uh, plum bussy into uh, that wedding. I was like, it might just be the two of them. They might be having a cheeky little elopement, but geez louise, they made it count. Fireworks and everything. We are gonna complain about the rain. She wants to play baseball. Oh my god, she really said this rain is making it feel like ha 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 weather. Sorry, I can't stop making that joke. I need to get it out of my system. I need to watch Twilight soon. Cornelius is too sad to snuggle. <gasps> Cornelius, no, sir. Why don't you, can we sit? Okay, we can sit together. I don't know if we'll actually be able to do any romantic interactions. I'm feeling very unsatisfied in our relationship if you're mean to me. <gasps> she doesn't like something that I have been doing. I don't know what it is that she doesn't like we need to ask her advice so we need to see what she actually enjoys flirting and physical intimacy okay i mean i feel like we can kind of work with that she likes affection though right oh she's trying to give herself a pep talk she's like you can do this a present for you uh, why did that sound like he was speaking english i didn't like it uh oh we are level four in romance though this is like my black widow challenge all over again when she was too sad she had actually killed off her husbands and then we couldn't continue to uh, romance the others that was an unsuccessful uh, date which I'm not surprised about considering he was just very sad for the whole time. But luckily that's disappearing after 12 hours. So I'm just gonna probably have him do his homework and then head to bed. And then fingers crossed we can wake up in a better mood tomorrow. Also, yes, I did see all of these up here, but I felt for the story, it was right if maybe we are overdue on our rent. He's just lost his dad. Like, I'm sorry, the last thing he is thinking about is appeasing his landlord even if he does want to be one when he grows up he's feeling a little tied to uh, some my shoe know i decided why not go uh, for a little uh, karaoke bar session so we're gonna go uh, to uh, waterside warble take two uh, of actually ticking off the things that we need for this day he uh, got over his father's death quite quickly <laughs> we still haven't been to the family mausoleum yet honestly i'm kind Kind of excited to see if the life and death expansion does add in like actual graveyards to uh, the sims 4 because that would be a uh, perfect for what we actually have like in this series in particular the rumors are true wants to go to prom with cornelius hell yes i wanted to ask you but i just wasn't really in the mindset not us setting it up right in front of a pile of poop you know what i kind of love Terrell. I love the energy that he is bringing. Let's watch the sky with her and see if it does count towards it. But considering it only says one of those two interactions, I have a feeling it's not going to. I hate how they constantly have to get up and like talk about doing a thing before they actually just do the thing. Oh, looking at the stars does actually help. And we completed our resolution. Heck yes. So we needed to complete a milestone of our aspiration. We need to discuss romantic boundaries, have a romantic partner and embrace three at time. Ooh, they got the steamy dynamic. <laughs> not the high five afterwards she said okay that's enough we are gonna keep that distance perform 25 romantic gestures with a partner sim achieve level seven in romance and get gold on a date we're actually gonna attempt to get gold on this one. Oh, uh, well hello <laughs> Not him spawning in all mysteriously in a puff of black smoke looking like this. And he's singing my favorite song, Absolute Bop. I told you it was starting to feel like Twilight Season. 
An acquaintance was telling me how much they dislike you. Try being a little nicer. I like how uh, our best friend of like years, who we know is mean, is trying to offer me that advice. Not her pulling that for the date. It could be crying with laughter. Maybe he's just really made her giggle. Oh, we're pushing it so close. 15 minutes and we managed to get gold on a romantic i hope this was a romantic day oh my god i think this is like friendly if it's a get to know you day i would simply cry i would rage quit i would be out of here i wonder how many times i've actually rage quit throughout this series i feel like it's actually quite a lot now all we need to do is go up two in our romance skill just have a couple more romantic gestures i want to grab some posters I want to remember the dates in San Myshuno. I don't know why he has like such a love for San Myshuno, but I'm kind of here for it. I'm really vibing. Maybe we'll throw the climbing gym actually down in San Myshuno so that him and Guy kind of have a reason to come here more often. You're overdue on your rent. Your unit rating has gone down. The property owner may come by to repossess your objects as payment and our company. I mean, I want to pay our bill. I just don't want to pay our rent. I like how uh, they're all done by angsty, like Banksy. I love this game sometimes. Sometimes she really grinds my gears. Other times I'm like... <laughs> I see you. Affecting your rating. Yeah, whatever. We're still a level five though, aren't we? I love how I have such a beef with Panya. <laughs> this man does not even know uh, that we have beef. He was such good friends uh, with our father. And now uh, he's got Nepo Baby who uh, hates him. Every morning when he wakes up, he uh, starts watching reality dating TV shows. <laughs> Obviously, because it does help with his romance. But now I feel uh, like he's just getting ideas for romance based off these reality TV dates. We also only have 10 more romantic gestures with a partner sim. Also, we still have, do we even have the self-sufficient NAP on this lot? Check neighborhood action plans. Yes, we do. And the foodies unite, which is why we're getting spammed with a white cake. Why are those like the most prominent ones? Why when I'm not voting, they always come into power? It's so annoying annoying. I also love how we're in spring and people are still wearing their father winter get up. What is this? Is that a fish? Oh my goodness, they got koi in the fountain. I love how uh, fountains are now like swimmable water. Like for some reason, they're like, oh yeah, this fountain in the middle of Ciudad Enamorada can be uh, like usable and you can like interact with it. But this one in the middle of Tomarang, no. Why would you ever think that you uh, would be able to uh, interact with that? Exchange promise rings. Well... I don't know. I think we're gonna hold off on that for a little bit. Recap mess around. So he's like, can I get some tips? I am taking all feedback on board. 25 romantic gestures done. And I have to say, his romance skill is actually going up really, really quickly. I'm quite shocked. Love how everyone is using their phones <laughs> before the exam starts. That is not true to real life. They would have those bad boys right out of your hand also why do they have to do exams like every uh, friday is it meant to be uh, like a uh, pop quiz kind of deal it just feels far too formal it's so scary when you see all the timings like this written on a board do not do uh, your extra credit work oh my goodness gracious me what is going on take your exam you're gonna fail is it also really bad already a level five in logic that I'm like, we have done logic so many times over in this short lifespan legacy that I now like, I kind of want him to focus on programming, which does link to logic, but obviously it's a completely different skill. Oh, we are absolutely relying on our logic. He is good at that. Oh, it's such a bad, I don't even know if this is like considered a glitch in the, the game, but as soon as you get that like fear of being alone or unsatisfied in a relationship, your romantic relationship goes down so 
fast. Like they're prom dates and they currently don't have any romance. Maybe we should graduate early because then at least that gives us like, but then we're just like doing what we're doing right now, but at home. Um, But we also have time to like work on our programming. But I don't know why. I kind of want to do graduation this time around. I feel like it would be quite fun with Cornelius. It's been a while since we've done a graduation. I chose to give her a romantic oh. gift and it came up with our dancer tombstone. Imagine if we just gave that to her. You'd be so scared. Oh, she's actually gone and asked us to watch the stars together. Who lives in this house? Oh, this is the Price household. Cause I'm like, Kevin is absolutely sneaking out of those windows. Guy is wondering if I wanna go over to his house. Oh, like, you know Guy is gonna be so pissed off that we've ditched him for a girl. God, this bird has been sat up here for hours. Are you not numb? Not moving. Refuse. Oh, actually it did move a little bit. That was creepy. Looked directly into the camera. What has happened here? Are you okay, Octavia? Oh, she's really, really pissed off. And now Thorn has joined her. No wonder. I'd be pissed off with a thorn in my side as well. Damn, we got our relationship right back up there. Why is this park so dark? I know they probably tried to make it look like natural to like fit in with the landscape, but you can't see anything. Also, I am shocked that there's not a barbecue in here. I mean, at least from what I can see, no one's made food. I told you he had caught the San Myshuno bug. Because he's so tied to DeAndre in my mind, he's like the closest heir we've had to our founder. It just feels like he has some weird tie to him. Guy has actually invited him out to the gym to kind of work on his sweat, get him pumped before prom. So Guy is still being quite sweet. Guy's like, don't worry, I want you to like impress this girl. I am a little bit peeved off that you've ignored me for a girlfriend, but it's fine. Obviously that is exciting and like, I'm your bro, I'm gonna try and be happy for you. He also has started his rock climbing skill. So fingers crossed, we should be able to get a level 10 in this. I don't know. I just see him eventually like owning one of these, like actually in his place. We're in this sweet little gym, which by the way, ignore this masseuse over here. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Kanichi. Didn't want this gym being like too uh, fancy because one day he hopes to like be up here. Like there's a really nice rock climbing gym that I placed in like the uptown district of San Myshuno. That's where his hopes and dreams lie. He's like one day when I'm ripping people off as a landlord, that's where I uh, wanna be. But after he's finished this climb, even though uh, Guy is the one who invited him over, we are actually gonna invite over Gloria. Yes, absolutely. Please like rock climbing. That would be so good. I don't think Guy's gonna be too impressed with this. Who else have we got? <gasps> Not Rafa. Oh my goodness gracious me. Rafa's still a young adult. I need to turn aging on. You know how I said he reminds me of DeAndre? Why is this man literally the spitting image? I say that as if not all of my randomly generated townies are wearing DeAndre. DeAndre's hair. Like it's really not surprising that DeAndre came out of Create Sim wearing the hair that he was because so many of my Sims use it. I was saying just the other day, I need to take the custom content out of my game that randomly generated townies wear, but then they're gonna look so weird if I do that. <gasps> Guys walking out. Oh, he, I feel like he defo had to see that. Sorry that you can't relate, Guy. Now we only need to achieve level seven in romance and we're so close to it. We're currently 74. Promise to skip prom together. <gasps> Why do I feel like he would do that and then like go to prom anyway? He's like, you're right. I haven't been spending time with my bro. Oh, uh, he looked really, really offended then. I agree. Let's ditch prom together. It's a pact. 
Oh, he's going to be so peeved. It's been wonderful to spend time with you. I'm sure we'll make many more great memories. Oh, he's trying so hard to like be his friend and be supportive in this guy. I love you. That's my guy. We're having a get together before prom. Nah, we need to let guy think that we're like avoiding prom. We're only going to go to prom. We're not going to go to the pre-party. His end enemy has arrived. Leave me alone. I don't want to be shown memes on your phone. We don't like each other. I'm glad we've made an enemy though. Feels like it's really gonna tie into our story when we do become a landlord. He could actually do this. He's on 90% right now. He's still reading his book. No, stop listening to music. <gasps> Guy wants to go to the romance festival. Guy really said, I see that you want to be a risk master. How about you come to the romance festival and we can learn it from a guru. Or is Guy actually trying to get us to go to the romance guru to see if we are with the love... Is he trying to sabotage our relationship? I think that might be what's going on. I'm getting really, really annoyed with you constantly turning on music. Like, can you just go read outside? It's almost time for prom. And you're only 7% of completing your aspiration. This is wild behavior. I can't believe we may have managed to do this in one video. That's so annoying. We almost had it. Actually, I was going to play prom in the next part. I think if we just do some like romance interactions here, we are good. I really hope Guy isn't at prom. He's, but he's going to be so sad. He wanted to go to uh, the romance festival instead. Is our date even here? They don't even like spawn in anymore. Oh my God, she is here wearing something awful. Prom royalty is obviously going to be Gloria. I wonder if dancing with someone that gets up our romance. 100% complete. He didn't even need to dance. Cornelius can now perform steamy makeout and build up partner with other Sims. Aspiration complete. We managed to do it. Oh uh, my goodness gracious me. And that is where we are gonna wrap up. Thank you all so much for being here. I'm absolutely loving Cornelius. Now I'm kind of tempted to have him graduate early so that we can start working on his programming. Definitely let me know if you think that sounds like a good idea. Also start to leave your name suggestions. Obviously, oh yeah, cool. This is a really, really nice slow dance. You look really caring. He's still looking so mad about that argument that he had with Guy. Not Pace Collect trying to steal my girlfriend. I see that top hat. I see your game. Never mind. He's he's dancing with Elder. I will speed you all in my next one. Bye now.